Well, a 4-3 shootout loss tonight for the Toledo Walleye here at home to the Orlando Solar Bears, spoiling a standing room only crowd of over 7,800 tonight. Uh, they've got the jersey auction going on down on the ice. And Scott, uh, this is one of those games where I think uh, Dan Watson said it, Nick Fatusi said it, not really gonna change too much after this game because you did pretty much everything right tonight. Yeah, you generated a lot of chances, no question, Matt. You know, especially in the first and third period, so many good things happened. We, Nick wanted speed, he wanted to puck behind the Orlando defenseman, that happened and we were able to generate just an enormous amount of chances uh, in those two periods. And then clearly, you don't change much, you just uh, you know hope that the next time the goalie's not making as many saves as he did tonight. And in a game like this though, as we take a look at your Huntington Bank highlights of the game, Scott, you do come away with a point too on a night when a goaltender is stopping just about everything, which those can mean something too when we get close to playoff time. Well, the points are really important here. Do you see the reason why we got the one point tonight, the goals by Svensson early, Rogers, again, resulting from a lot of good play early. But that goal that Orlando, right after the uh, Rogers goal, kind of got them back in it. We see the scramble around the net making it 2-1. And after that, everything kind of came uh, Orlando's way in the second period, giving them the 3-2 lead. The goal by Tansky, the 2 on 0 goal here by Reeves. He's able to finish off a perfect uh, passing combination off the 2 on 0 before Lample again joining the rush, making it 3-3 which gave us the opportunity to get to the shootout, whereas we saw ultimately the Orlando able to uh, finish things off with the goal there uh, by Gender, and then finished off there winning the shootout. The stats obviously clearly in favor of the walleye with the shots on huge shots on goal edge this evening. Yeah, really dominating performance. The 0 for 4 on the power play. You heard head coach Nick Petusi talk about that, Scott. Uh, something that is, it, it just, you need practice time to really work on that. Toledo really hasn't had that over the last couple of weeks. And with the roster kind of flipping around an awful lot, you got a lot of new players in there and players that are not used to even being in that position. Yeah, Nick was very clear on that. You get, uh, you like an opportunity to at least work on some chemistry, get some combinations out there. Haven't had that with the uh, with the schedule and all the changes in the lineup, but that'll, that'll come. And have more time together, it'll give them the opportunity again to get to learn each other, learn the moves, learn the combinations, and uh, get that power play going. Well, Scott will do it again tomorrow as the Kalamazoo Wings come to town here to Toledo. 5:05 puck drop. Here at the Huntington Center, you can get your tickets now at ToledoWalleye.com to join us here in downtown Toledo. Well, that's going to do it from here. For my broadcast partner, Scott Pollock, and our entire crew, my name is Matt Melzack. Once again, your final score, the Orlando Solar Bears taking down Toledo tonight in a shootout 4-3. to three.